Darth Krait, born Azharad Het, revered as the Dragon of the Sith, and known to some members of the Skywalker family as the Dark Man, was a long-lived Force-sensitive human male who served as both a Jedi Master in the waning days of the Galactic Republic and as Dark Lord of the Sith following the fall of Darth Sidious. The son of legendary Jedi Knight Sherard Het and his wife Kazheek, both of whom lived among the Tusken Raiders of Tatooine, he eventually became the Padawan of Jedi Masters Kiadi Mundi, and later, Anya Kuro. When he was only a teen, Het's father was murdered by the ex-Jedi assassin Aura Singh, who was later defeated in a duel by young Azharad Het. During the Clone Wars, he served the Republic as a general and established himself as a charismatic leader who often led his troops from the front. He eventually became friends with the young Anakin Skywalker and helped Anakin come to terms with the destruction which had been wrought by the galaxy-wide war. Azharad took part in key conflicts during the war such as the Battle of Boz Pity and the Siege of Seleucami. He managed to survive the Clone Wars, and was one of the few Jedi known to have escaped the Great Jedi Purge in 19 BBY. Azharad Het eventually made his way back to his homeworld of Tatooine where he vowed to wage a private war against the New Galactic Empire. However, after a confrontation with Jedi Master Obi-Wan Kenobi, he was exiled from Tatooine and later discovered that it was Anakin Skywalker who became the Sith Lord Darth Vader, who he had aided in the annihilation of the Jedi Order. Azharad blamed himself for the destruction of the Jedi Order, as he had known about Anakin killing of a village of sand people, and could have reported the young Jedi, thus getting him expelled, but did not, considering it Anakin's personal responsibility to deal with his own dark deeds, and became a bounty hunter. During one of his missions, he found himself on Korriban, where he trained as a Sith under the tutelage of the Dark Lord Xox Arn. Het eventually fell to the dark side after capture and torture by the Yuzhan Vong and soon proclaimed himself Dread Lord and Dark Lord of the Sith taking the name, Darth Krait. As Krait, he became the founder and leader of the One Sith during the period of the Vong invasion. He kept the existence of his rebuilt Sith Order hidden from the Jedi for a century by cloaking their presence on Korriban. At one point in 44 Abbey, he emerged to fight alongside Luke Skywalker against Abeleth. To survive, the Dark Lord spent many years in stasis before re-emerging to form an alliance with Moff Nina Kallaxt and to spark the Sith Imperial War that led to the destruction of the Galactic Federation of Free Alliances. At the climax of the war, he deposed Emperor Ron Fell and brought about the destruction of the New Jedi Order. Darth Krait ruled the galaxy with an iron fist for seven years before the alliance between rightful Emperor Ron Fell and Galactic Alliance Admiral Garstazi threatened his usurped rule. Furthermore, Krait discovered the existence and survival of a Skywalker, Cade. Krait feared that with these deteriorating conditions and his bad health would lead to his demise before his dream was finished, and sent about the hunt for Cade Skywalker. However, during a skirmish on Had Abaddon, Krait was stabbed and sent hurtling off a cliff. The Sith Lord's powers proved strong, however, when they saved his life. Darth Krait was then approached by Darth Wyerlich, his most trusted advisor, who murdered Krait, believing the Dreadlord would lead to the Sith Order's destruction. But, even as he was inactive, Krait's ideals were being carried out by Wyerlich in his place. Krait later healed his body from his death experience. Overcoming the taint of his armor, he called out to all those across the galaxy who had touched the dark side, signaling his return. With the aid of loyal Sith and a new breed of Sith troopers, Krait retook Coruscant, slaying Darth Wyerlich in the process, and began making preparations to rebirth the galaxy through war. However, in the final battle, he once again attempted to turn Cade Skywalker. He failed to do so, and while distracted in the attempt was slain by Cade, who incinerated his corpse to prevent the ghost of Krait from simply resurrecting his dead body. Even after his physical death, Krait's ideals were carried on by his loyal followers.